Hello, hello. Welcome to Game Audio Life. It's your host, Chase Bathia. We're here live on a happy Thursday for Indicade. Ah, how is the chat doing? What's going on? What's going on? Eplas, hello, welcome. Thank you. Shout out to Eplas, the moderator. Super appreciate you having you here. All right. So yeah, welcome to Game Audio Life. So we are going to be doing some cool stuff today. But first, always a little bit of housekeeping. Indicate, right? Awesome freaking festival. They're doing anywhere and everywhere. What is Indicate though? You know, this year is going to be October 16th through the 24th. It's going to be virtual, but it's all good. It's going to be celebrating independent games. And I'd be remiss kind of last, last time we kind of didn't uh, give some shout out to some of those nominees that were mentioned. So I saw some cool stuff here. I just want to show and uh, give a couple shout outs to that early. So we got Curious Expedition 2. We got Enlight. Hexa Groove, there's so many nominees. So shout out to all the nominees. They're super awesome. There's so really great stuff in here. Lucifer Within Us, that seems pretty cool. There's one further down here where I saw. It was a uh, Sword Swallower and many more. So I'll probably do a couple shout outs to those at the end of the show and stuff like that. But be sure to check out the Kickstarter as well. They're so close to the goal. $27,626, dollars are trying to hit 30K. Can we make it 50K? Can we do 50K? I don't know. We got to see. Let's make it happen. So now that we got that stuff out of the way, got my let it dies gone. We're making farm music and I'm actually not even close. <laughs> I have so many cool things to share. So last week we did some cool things and we've got some new stuff to share as well. I've got to log in to the demo now because it was such in demand for the farm music it was doing. So I'm writing some music for this game called Heroes Farm. And the first time we did this, we had more of this intro and then we had the extension and then we did a second part. Now my goal is to possibly fiddle around with FMOD. FMOD is a middleware. It's to see and think about like how it links to events. So I'm going to play the music, and then I'm going to get the game booted up, and then we're going to go from there. I'm trying to cook up some... I have to do combat music with this farm game. I don't know how I'm going to do this. I'm, I've got a couple ideas, and I'm just going to noodle. It's not going to be anything crazy or serious. But we'll see what we come up. We've been pretty productive for the past two episodes. This is episode three of Game Audio Life, and we're going to, we're going to see what we can get done. What's going on? Welcome, Doc. Writing some farm music today, you know how it is. Oh, I think we found a bug. <laughs> bug. All right, let's return to the game. Uh, I don't want to save and quit. I need to figure out how to do the night music for this. Is 
this playing the group version? It's so calming. Yes, I'm glad. I'm so I'm glad it's so calming because it is farm music and you don't but today I gotta write combat music. How am I gonna write combat music for this? <laughs> After writing this, you'll be surprised. how to do the night cycle one but we're getting close to there now this should be playing oh it's on loop that's why you didn't hear the other part let's do this one this must be the edge beyond the mountains is the waste of lands you have either to be crazy or a hero to go there so that's become a hero on the farm isn't that kind of interesting supposed to grow crops and become a hero. Okay, well, my task today is to figure out how to make combat music based off of a chord that's in here. So I've got some interesting things. I've got this book that I picked up in Montana called Marvin Kahn's Breaks, Fillers, Endings, and Introductions. And this book is actually pretty nifty. And I'm really excited to kind of do that and like take some stuff out of this and see what we get. And then I came up with some cool chord stuff. So I want to play that for y'all now. And this is what I'm thinking is going to start off with the, like the, the music in terms of the, the, what is it called? The combat. this too. So that's a small concept that I came up with. It's not sure. It's still manifesting. And then this one. But I need to find the chord, the pivot chord. So, hmm. let's think. I think we're just gonna have to write it and mess with it later. So I was writing this little bass line thing here. What I'm going to do is a little something different. Yeah, get that work lurk going on. Go get him, Doc. Get the work lurk going. I'm going to work lurk myself. <laughs> You're like, how do you do that? You're streaming. Well, you'll find out. I'm working and I'm lurking inside of the music software. All right, this is really tough. This is really, I'm trying to really think about this. I have to think about what event that it's gonna align to. Let's get familiar, more familiar. I guess the first thing I'm gonna be to think about is combat music that I wanna do. We're gonna pull up a small orchestral palette. Nothing crazy, just something very minute. Let's see if this all works. I'm just pull up the strings and let's see how this sounds.
That's out of range, so that's why. Um, <laughs> working with some awesome tunes at Blast is Right. Thank you. Appreciate it. We want to see how awesome the tunes are. Maybe this wasn't the right thing to load. I need to see, I need a rhythm pace based thing and I need to up the tempo. I think we're just gonna have to go with what we have and then it'll come to us along the way. Let me get a feel for what the game is telling me. See, so the problem is I don't have the combat. Maybe this person over here will attack me. Let's see. What event will it be? Oh, the developer's in the chat. Awesome. Welcome, Fancy Fish Games, to the chat. Awesome. So combat happens at night. You can sleep or cheat to skip the night. Fancy Fish Games, how do I do that? <laughs> how do I cheat and skip? Please tell me. I'd love to know. As I don't remember. Perfect. So this, since this is the night music, this is why we're going to actually keep this in the same session. Is this thing going to attack me? Why can't? Attack me. Hit me. No, don't talk to me. Just just do it. I believe I have to go into the developer console to, to kind of get it done. But I don't remember the shortcut to that because it's been a while. I want to do something like that. Yes, the cheat codes are in the chat, folks. Here it is. Let's go. So that's what it was. Alt Shift D. And then, oh, Fancy Fish Games. Thank you so much. So let's do state. This is the cool stuff I like to do in my day. Day. And then 0 0.05. And up. Oh, oh, and he's responding. Oh, I'm excited. <laughs> okay, so let's, uh, Let's copy that command because we're going to need that for later. All right. So here's what I'm thinking. This is the nighttime. This was that weird part, right, that we wrote last week. Come on. Where is it? I thought we looked this. There it is. That was too far. It's almost morning. Ah, oh, okay. Gosh. I think I, I saw it. Yeah, okay. So let's do it again. All shifty. State ink day. So I think it was on its way out. There we go. Is this gonna do? Is there a clock on here? <laughs> yeah, there's a clock right there. Okay, so yeah, this is my time now. All right, perfect. Now let's go. Now, now I can. Now I can think about it. That's what I want to do. The enemies will be on the right side or heading towards you. Let's go towards the enemies. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. I want this encounter to happen, like this pivot for the event. Uh, select my weapon to the axe. Oh, oh, geez. This is kind of like Castle Crashers almost now. <laughs> um, where's my axe at? Which is for, yes. Thank you. Let's go. Oh, ah. Uh, I want to see some hit faces like, ah, uh, when it gets hit. <laughs> Get these buddies. They're coming for you. 
There it is. It was a brief hit face. There it is. I love it. It's like when it gets hit. We should have shields. Okay. I'm getting ideas now. Thank you, Fancy Fish Games, with the clutch. Okay. This chord here. It should work with this. Okay, it will. So let's go back. Let's put a little small loop. It's only going to be two, so we'll do four bars. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. But we're doing this in the wrong spot. We've got all this stuff here. We need to put this somewhere around here. Oops. Okay, so let's go back. Make it to four bars. One, two, that's five. Okay, let's just get this concept down. Okay, what I'm gonna do. Uh, so I'm gonna try and do something different from the combat music you're typically not used to, you're typically used to hearing and then change it up. That's usually what I do anyway when I write this type of music. Then I need to have this, uh, this, I have this like really descending weird thing happening in my head. Something like that, I need to kind of push it out. Let's see how that is. This will not one here. Not that. Not that one. Let's try to maximize this a little bit. Let's do this one. There, that's kind of close to what I was thinking. Now, oh, thank goodness that air kicked in. I was sweating like bullets. Let's get this one. Yeah, that's what I wanted. It's not interesting with that little trill. Uh, definitely this is gonna be Zero two. Okay. There we go. Let's make sure we record that. Now we're going to have a three bar type of. So this is kind of the small idea. Okay, so now, here's the hard part. Let's move this down here. What is the time signature of this? 6A? Okay, this would be fine. It would be, I want to kind of keep it 
simple if I do everything I don't know I don't really understand what's going on <laughs> okay nope that's the whole thing chord is let's see if it's this so if it this is no far from where it should be. No, it's not a rub. It's not that either. So think about it again. I'm not sure why I'm struggling with that. It's just a step down. <laughs> important. Is that in there? Yeah, it is. Okay. close we need to hear the actual intervals of it mm, this one's not here okay this is correct wow Eplus, you like it <laughs> not correct. This is correct. This is close. Let's listen to it just just the charango. Yeah, it is a puzzle. Trust me, it's a puzzle in my brain that I am definitely I have <laughs> I have not solved. I'm looking at a blank canvas 
And that is the biggest puzzle it could possibly be. Especially since I really don't know how it's going to fit at all. I just, the experimentation comes through by doing. But at least I have a foundation and then I can at least, like I need, I need to have the idea and sonically hear something in order to work with it. Is that a repeated note? I don't like that note. Can we mute that note? Yes, that's better. But can we drop that G? This might be out of range, but actually this is what I wanted. So let's see what the G, B, E, G, and this is, this is it? So this is same. There it is. That's the chord I wanted. No, not this one. Okay, now that we have this, now I can work with stuff. Typically, I have a hand drum. I'll probably record that externally. I won't do that on the stream live because it's going to take a lot of setup to do. I have to like get a mic stand, put the mic together, and then get out of chair and test the thing. And I don't have the mic. Yeah, I'm not there yet. <laughs> so we're gonna we're just gonna get the framework down, and we're gonna go to what's the frame drum I was thinking of? I think it's called. Think about the library. What is the library you want? Think about it. What is it called? What is it called? It's coming to me slowly. I don't remember the name of the drum. I think I have to see it. Oh, it's right in front of me. <laughs> Drums of War. All right. So, Hell's Deep. Yeah, we can do that. We just need the framework. Um, so, Drums of War. Um, let's make sure that we're on the right output. We might need our own drums for this. So let's make our external part of this here. Drums, pull up our mixer. Let's pull it, it's up there. Let's put it down here. Epic puzzles, yeah. Pull this up, give this a different color. And we want the drums to be on the stereo out. I've learned this because they're just so thick in sound that it muddies up the sound if you have everything else in, with the entire mix. Okay, so that's a roll. Okay, let's try to tighten it up. Might have to layer it with something else. What else do we have? Combat drum. Let's layer it with that. Okay, so one. There we go. And we don't want it too loud, so let's pull down the mix. Let's, it's a little boomy in the lower end, so let's cut that there. And then let's cut about 200 here. Turn that on. Cool. Yeah, it's good. And guess what? We're not going to do a lot of work. So we're just going to delete the upper part here um, and a lot of this extra stuff. Um, 
we'll keep that here and delete this here. Okay, so now we just need to move this up. Yep. That's the note it's gonna be on. Delete this, move this one up. Okay, so now it's Take this one off. One and two. There we go. And then give the right velocity. It's a hard hit early. Then down, then up, then down. A little higher on that one than this one here. Then uh, so. body not that body even more boom all right okay now we have to figure out the baseline. added something there. We'll fix out the notes later. It's important that we just get the idea down. And this is going to be a trill, of some, not a trill, but like a 60, 30 second note to kind of lead into this. There we go. We got to move it back just a little bit. faster. Okay, so we did a lot of work. We want to make sure we save it. There we go. There's that extra note. And then near the end. There we go. Then we could just crawl 
all this baseline up here. Let's see what the notes are saying. What's this? Yeah, I think that's kind of like a grace note, a gross note rather. Let's pull this one down here. And sharpen it. No, don't do that. Oh man, killing me. There we go. I want to creep that up. Oops, not that much creep. Let's see if this works. in the chat so many subtleties <laughs> subtleties yeah there's a a lot that i want to kind of add into it my brain is kind of like okay really what we're trying to go with here the game telling me in terms of instrumentation get ready to fight okay just from that I got a couple ideas Um, I'm going to do something a little bit for texture. Uh, I think I already have the instrument here. Is it hit? Okay, we need more. It's not enough. Battle drum, combat drum. Really what I need to do is refine the drum. Just really get it perfect. Stop moving this. Okay. Oh, 
I kind of like that. I swear. <laughs> Let's add this one in. I'll take the gain out of it. Take that one. Let's add this. It's too much. Let's see what the body offers. We don't like the body. It's too much decay. Oh, man. Okay, let's try this again. That's good. Next. Pretty good. Let's see if we can get more. Seems good. That's better. Now I want to space that a little bit out, so let's do a different inversion of it. Not the burn bound though. It's something else is it's here, but it's not here. Where is it at? Hmm. I'm trying to think. Where else could it be? It's almost morning for this one. He's just knocked out. Oh. I understand now. Um, we're going to have to dig into the library over here. So let's look at some sample library thingies. There's harmonicas, saxophone, drums. Oh yeah, we need to kind of delete this little playlist thingy here. Pull this back up to 90. There we go. Pull this in here, put it on drums, put it down. Okay, now what we'll do is we'll just adjust it to the duration that it should be. We'll have to stretch it into place. Hopefully it works. Let's see if this not it. Yep. Wait. 
EQ this part out. Take the metronome off. Just pan it out a little bit. <laughs> Kill him. Thank you. Thank you, Bless. Appreciate you. Uh, we don't want to do that. We want to do the mono. Space. So I'm probably not going to put it on the drums. I'm going to put it on the mix down to see what happens. And then we'll pull it down to volume. thinking of doing uh, okay so this is foundational we're gonna probably change this as we go but as a start it's better than nothing. I'm pretty sure if I look hard enough, I'll find something better. Yep, told you. So the trick is to get this to play. I think I can just stretch this to here. Then decide what I want to cut based off of the drum pattern. shorten it a little bit. I'm not sure how this is going to go. Let's listen to it. and get it to the metronome first. Let's hear what we can hear what we hear. So right now we have a...
Here's the deal. We gotta figure out how we can mix this fit. So let's stretch this out again and make it fit into the beat. That might actually work. Not going to delete it necessarily. I'm just going to kind of look for something else, but we're getting close. That could work. We're just going to put it there. This one's bothering me a lot. So we're going to pull down this a little bit. And we're going to just add on. There we go. Something happened magically. something going on I can do this three more times and then I copied something that would I think be all right to do initially 
So what we'll do is I'll immediately come into the combat, but not have the drums play just yet. Let's cut that there. Move that. Mute this, mute this. We'll have this part play. And we'll have this part play. Okay, so let's try it. Oh, when move this here. beginning this isn't where i'm going to take this at all this is going to be the comic is going to be way more fleshed out but we got to start somewhere and this this pad here really gives me this nice feeling of where i want the strings to kind of go the problem is i got to be careful because i got to i don't know what kind of strings i want So we're going to keep moving it forward. And now it's, we'll have the string part come in here. So let's save what we got. This is pretty good. I'm starting to feel a little bit better about it. from the beginning, get the filling of it. We won't have this, this play twice. So we'll mute that here and here. So get the feeling. And also we need to make sure that the chords are written because I don't want to figure out that later. The chord is, oops, ooh, that's kind of, oh crap, I changed it. I need to change, why did you do that? Thank you, okay. That was kind of cool though. So now at least we have the chord. And I think I know what's going on here is this space note here. Let's try to get the...
just move that note here. And it'll repeat again. So it's okay. Where is it? Do we? There we go. Okay, so we'll add it on. And I'm putting that note not there, but here. Quick and dirty. Just tighten it up a little bit, making sure that it all connects. Now it does. So now this is an. Now there's going to be a key change. Uh, yes, well that will be later, but there's going to be a key switch. And what I want is this one here. Let me go mute these. Won't be a key change necessarily right away, but we're going to add, we're going to layer on to what we got with the different feeling. Not there, but here. Okay, so save it. Okay, let's play with the game. articulation um, the articulation needs to change looking at this here somewhere down there pull this to the right just really quick and what are we thinking about oh we need to change the, the key switch that's what it is so, can this mark me where I'm at? Shouldn't be that up there. We're not gonna really do this? Okay, so it should be Somewhere around here. Let's see if this works. Okay, that one didn't work. Let's do this one. Actually. 
I don't want to do that. And I'm going to tell you why. I don't want to create that necessarily there, but I do want to create it here. And so what we'll do is make sure that this is still the same. Okay, we messed up. Because we're on this one, right? Okay, we gotta take this off. Okay, that's all I want. Okay, that's cool. Combat violin. There we go. Put it in the the mix. Take this out, and we're gonna really get creative. line again. I didn't want like a full like string part. I just wanted something like a little bit more edgy. Hold on, why is that? Why is that doing it? You shouldn't be doing that.
making sure this is correct. So that's twice. This is a little bit longer, but this is for good reason because I'm adding. Oh, you know what? I have a brilliant idea for. Okay, so for extra, we're going to add this little twinkle thing, right? I need to hear it in the piano. This is all I want to do. there change it out let's do this one up here and this one down here to keep it less more productive Less predictable. Now we take the same thing. Sure, don't have to copy it because I'm just going to move it down here. Oops. Adjust the volumes. So this will happen when you hit the enemies. Only when you hit them. Let's uh let's try the let's try it. If we, it's getting more intense. baseline for this part so I'm thinking like let's listen to it again We have to test our theory in real time. I'm curious about this actually. Yeah, it's fighting music, it's combat music. Um, writing combat music but it has to transition during the nighttime which is good because I didn't want to write the music for during the daytime all right so just for context all we had was this chord idea in the beginning really initially what I wanted to write was this one and then, but I decided to go with, and then this one. And then we came up with this. And while I'm writing this, the reason it's taking a little bit longer is because I'm trying to figure out how it's gonna align with the events of the game. So I keep playing the game, I keep looking at it, I keep going back, I keep changing it, I keep adding stuff. Send 200 food to the capital? Yeah, sure, why not? 
Now you're broke. <laughs> uh, as you can tell. So, yeah, I'm hoping that more enemies will come. We need to restart the game. So let's go ahead and do such. I'm going to quit. Save and quit. Let's go to this other save we have here. I wish I could delete these. If you kill them all, uh, more come every day. So if you kill them all in the day, again, more come every day. Did I kill them all? I went all the way to the right. Oh, that's what you're saying. Developers in chat sh showing me the way. Uh, be clean. So we got to reset the day. I'd rather do this this way. Oh, this isn't right. <laughs> Show me the way. Stay ink. Let's try. Day two. Oh, that's why. The intricacies. Oh, awesome. Cool. So let's start back from here. Oh, no. Come on. Thank you. Oh, I have an idea. When the enemies are spotted, it plays this chord. And as soon as the enemies are seen, and obviously, so that this chord is playing. I wonder if we could just do this one. The track comes in. The beat jumps in. I'm probably getting myself worked through it. Oh, let's see. Oh, okay, this is kind of tough. <laughs> this is where I'm probably going to pull F mod in, which I already have up, but I don't have programmed. But I can kind of at least start tinkering about it going from here. And I was supposed to get it set up at least this week, but I failed. Where are the enemies? Come back. I need this to work. Go left. We're going left. You know what? I'm going to pull the session over here for a second. Let's see if we can get this going. Let's see if we can. It's not going to work the way I want it to. Um, so what we're going to have to do is this. I need this. This is why it's good. To, this is next week. We're going to get this going. So I'm going to switch it based off of that. I'm going to close this. We're going to close that. And let's go here. Uh, switch game. Yeah. Yeah, probably. Let's get this going first, though. And the day is starting. So let's start it again, folks. <laughs> State. Um, no, it was just the case. It was just this one. This is how it was before, at least. All right, let's go. All right. No, that's wrong. Just testing out ideas. See, come on, come towards me. Come on. Oh, there we go.
<laughs> now it's not even hidden. They got to hit him in the front of it. Yep. Hit them. All right, well, it's coming together. I can always change it. It's just I need something to work with. <laughs> He's out, folks. He's tapped out. He's not strong enough. He won't become that hero. All right, well, that was a good test run and we definitely need f mod running because that is way too much work to, for what it's worth to go between both tabs and all that stuff so let's kind of refine some things now that we have some ideas so we wanted that chord thing though is, is going to be kind of interesting to have so what i'm going to do is i'm thinking obviously this layer section here to when we simply play it Thank you, Eplas. Appreciate it. <laughs> I think uh, I, it's not completely there, and obviously, there's a lot more that I, it's like a lot more up here. But I want to focus on what I have right now, and then we're gonna get into some bigger stuff like later on. So this this is at least the, the foundation, and what I'm hoping to do is kind of expand on it. But I appreciate it, Eplas. I appreciate it. So here's my idea. weird delay that we have on here yeah that's better okay so the layers of such will be indicative every time it won't always play and we'll randomize that in f mod when we put it in there i have to figure out how to learn how to do this again especially with music i haven't done it in a long time but it's going to be fun i'm getting more excited we need to figure out a baseline so let's go back to here if we do it a different way. So what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to flush out. I'm trying to create another texture in order in order to get the baseline to come to me in my mind. So I'm trying a different texture. Let's see if this works. Um, we need to see the chord first. Is the rub happening? So 
So it's root five. I don't see a rub. Oh, I see it now. I think I do. Um, yeah, now let's try something. It's always difficult for me to find these things. all the difference now the difference here specifically we need to offset it just a little bit I think that may or may not work. We'll see. Yeah, it did. Makes it feel cohesive. figure this out again. See if we can pull it off. It wasn't. It wasn't the greatest. Uh, let's try that again. It's too soon. Let's do it again. That's better. It's a triplet. We know that. So let's listen to it again. Uh, means you need to come back here. You should come back here. You should come back here. Okay. Pulled the whole note out. Not in triplet though. Just in this. You need to be in 32. 
And can you come there? Oh, this will be longer than it should. I like how the accents of the violins line up with the drums. Let's listen to it again. Yeah, I think it's a little fast, maybe. This part is so tough. Mm, we'll see how it feels. Let's take it off this. That's better. That's the feeling I wanted overall. So let's save that. here. This is the triplet here. This one here. This is the eighth note here. Let's see. Which means it needs to come in a little bit sooner. No, let's listen to it solo. Oh, duh, I had an extra note. Glad I listened to that. Okay, so this is the triplet here. Maybe it's a little 
closer. This is so tough. It's a little f closer than that. That's better. But it's an extra note there. How much you want to bet? No, I remember that being the right way. It's just going to be the same. Believe it or not, I'm going to play some different chords <laughs> so that your ears get a break. Okay, so this is here. This is the bass line I want to do. I'm going to do that later. Okay, so now... Try that it out. Let's try it out. Let's see what happens. So here's the bold thing we have to do. Come off of this. And so what I'm gonna do is I'm going to play around with some ideas. Jazzy victory dance. Yeah, so I'm not, I have a, so I'm so glad you mentioned this. Because the game is so lighthearted feeling, we can move this thing. thing. Oh, well, he really disappears. Okay, so he's just down. You can get back up. I don't want this to be, I can get, I can make it super dark and I don't want it to go that far. So my goal is to make it like, Oh man, he's getting knocked the hell out. <laughs> he got knocked the heck out. All right, so my goal is for it to be a beat. We should probably pause the game as we were suggested. And so. I can't I can't articulate it. It's just not the day to for words. I just have to keep using it. Oh, that's why I get my butt kicked. 
wasn't using the right weapon. I'm still low on health and everything too, so we're just gonna have to take a pause at. Um so what were we doing? Go back. That's not going to work, but we'll find out. So now we can get interesting. Here's something a little bit different if we try something a little bit different. You know, I'm not sure why it went past the bar because I sure have a loop cap on it. All right, so this is something new. I'm gonna change, save it to this. We have to come up with a new name for the combat music too. So I have to figure out how to get this into that. bigger feel for it. I'm just going to play around with some rhythms. Let's see if it's a... Uh, let's see if something comes from it. This is the only difficult part I have with this whole thing is just to come up with something different that's like what's the temp There we go. I think it's going to be that. We're just going to record that rhythm really quick. Keep moving things down. The goal is to get all the ideas out. You can edit this stuff later. Keeping it from going too dark, but it might be fun to just have the jazzy victory dance when you beat the enemies before switching it back to night. Yes, and we will get there when we, but we haven't got any, the combat music is still ruminating in my head. Trust me, I have not even scratched the surface of where it is. We can deal with the victory stuff. That's easy to write. That's not hard. That's just like a little stinger. We want this combat music to be different from, I mean, it's in a farming game. Like, I don't, 
<laughs> we got to make this stand out. It's got to be cool. So let's make that cool. But we will add that to the list. I wonder if I can pull that list up right now. Let's put it in drive. I'm going to add exactly what you said to the list. There it is. I'm literally going to add it to the list. We have a sound asset sheet list. And I'm just going to put... Jeez, this is not organized at all. I wonder if I should do this later. I'm just going to dump this here. So that we don't forget. And we can clean that up along the way. Victory music. More things to do. Yay. Awesome. So this is cool. I like this. Um, let's get the rhythm out of my head. Nope. Let's make sure we need bigger bars than that. That may not fit. Let's listen again. Oh, because it didn't start on the beat. Let's listen again. I got it finally. This is a triplet. We want this on the double. And this is just the first rhythm. And I haven't come up with the second one yet. This is going to be a little bit tough. So let's do the 30 seconds as they are. Put in 16th. That's kind of tough, isn't it? Then we need to change the triplet to the philo. That's better. At least it was counting it. No, 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 no. Do your job. Why? Why? No, it was right the first time. So it needs to be in 32, I guess. go with that we can tighten it up later and because I it will bug me so now that rhythm is this um, we need to make a new track so let's do a, a MIDI say okay make this one here 
Okay, so now this is the rhythm, and well, this is the chord. Put it, put this rhythm on this here. Let's see where it's coming from. <laughs> This is going to be a little tough, but we're going to try it. We're going to give it a shot. Okay, so what I'm going to do is this. Okay, so this is how we're going to do this. Getting close to the end of the stream. You may not get through this idea all the way. So we're just going to try to line it up. And it's not going to be nearly as fleshed out. I took a really big idea. And wanted to do something different, which is typically what I always do. Okay, so this is this one. Let's zoom this out a little bit. Let's zoom it out more so we can see it. What's going on? Why can't I see this all the way? There we go. Okay, so copy, zoom it in. Let's bring you down so I can see all of you. There we go, okay. So let's do this, copy. Duplicate, move this to there, duplicate. Oops, what are you doing? There, no, 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 we need to be careful about this. This was a triplets. So this has got to be lined up exactly the way it's lined up. Um, I guess we got to do this. Okay, let me duplicate that. That's there. Duplicate this. Once this part is done, at least it'll be the, the hard part is over. Okay, that's that. Okay. So if I did it right, um, it looks like it's out of range. So let's pull it up a little bit. Go up an octave. Actually, let's undo that. Put this up an octave. And Pull this up an octave. And let's pull this one up an octave. Okay. Okay, so it has got that piano playing. This is the new loop here. Of course it'd be six. Of course it is. Okay, so let's mute all of these. Too high. Let's go back down. Mm -hmm. And there. I'll change that rhythm another part later. want to get an idea of what it will be like. not in the give it the extra base zoom it out over here okay one Which will 
already got there. I'm just going to pull this here into this one. And then we're going to call it a stream there. gonna work we're gonna figure it out but we're gonna call a stream there uh, because we're getting close to the end so I got to do my typical things well you know the, all the usuals in the meantime so first and foremost I was writing for Heroes Farm developed by Fancy Fish Games work in progress this is definitely a work in progress like super placeholder art definitely not placeholder music <laughs> <laughs> and yeah we're working through everything you know and stuff like that but it's pretty much close to be you know being good and yeah i'm i'm so glad thankful for all of you who've been rocking me for the past two hours i really appreciate it indicate thank you so much appreciate you we've been watching game audio life with chase Bathia. without going i want to mention just again let's see here Oh, I appreciate the Eplus. I'm, I'm, I'm thankful that you're interested in like how it comes together because trust me, like it's all, it's all over the place in my mind. <laughs> Indicate's got a Kickstarter. Go check them out. Go share it, support it. Ooh, we got some things going on here. They're almost to the goal. We can make it fifty thousand dollars instead of thirty thousand. We always want to reach above that, get higher and higher and higher. Again, shout out to some other nominees. We got We Should Talk and the. Uh, they are a part of, I think, White Thorn, who also Fancy Fish developed, uh, um, Fancy Fish, like, co-publishing with the ground. So that's super cool. And Zenith Junction, Wide Ocean Jacket, all that cool stuff. And, yeah, like, it's been an amazing time. So I will see you next Thursday, episode four, where we continue trying to make the battle music for a farming-type game. No pressure. Not at all. <laughs> Meantime, I'm going to shut it down, boys. My champ, my show. You can catch me. You know where to find me. I'm on Twitter. And I'll see you next week. Bye, everyone. <laughs>